What's going on guys? On the form coming at you guys today with another video. In today's video, I'm still talking about um, the Detroit Lions draft. Um, I'm on to day three um, with the Detroit Lions. Um, I'm, I'm like a day or two behind all the time. I'm just trying to get caught up here, guys. Um, day three started with round four. We did not have a round four pick. So uh, we had to pick round five, number 177 overall. And we took tight end James Mitchell out of Virginia Tech, a Virginia Tech Hokie. At six foot three, two hundred fifty five pounds. Again, this is not a draft profile. I'm just going to talk a little bit about the kid, and uh, we'll, like we'll go from there. Um, later on, I'll be doing more of a deep dive on these players. But his stats were fifty two catches, eight hundred thirty eight yards, sixteen point one yards per catch. That was I was kind of impressed with that with those numbers. His yards per catch. So he 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 does have the ability to go upfield. Uh, only seven touchdowns and uh, I mean um, uh, five touchdowns. I believe it was seven or seven to five touchdowns. I I wrote seven and five touchdowns here. I don't know why I did that. So I don't know what I was trying to do here. <laughs> so he either had five or seven touchdowns. I'm not even too sure. Four years at Virginia Tech. Um, this one, this draft pick though, um, I will talk about it a little bit. Uh, it was a little bit of a head scratcher here. This is the kid that's been hurt the last two years with a fractured foot. Uh, a couple years ago, and then he had an ACL tear. Um, um, but a very, very good blocker in, in pass protection and in run protection. Um, he's very willing. He, he, Like I said, too, with that 16.1 yards per catch, um, he does have the ability to go upfield. He's got the basketball background. Uh, I'm not going to get too much into it, but he does have a basketball background, um, and he, he can get up and get the ball. He can box guys out. And he's decent size. He's a little undersized for a tight end, being at 6'3", uh, 255. But he's but he's a um, a pretty good athlete, very good athlete. So um, they took a little bit of a flyer here. I thought there were other guys on the board that they could have grabbed. This pick was a bit of a head scratcher to me. I don't I don't mind it. Um, I thought they could have went um, a, a, a different avenue. Even if it was tight end, there were some guys on the board that were probably better than him. But this is the guy they obviously liked. Um, so this is going to be a wait and see for me. Um, I will go more into a deep dive with these guys, like I said, but, um, tight end, uh, uh from Virginia Tech, James Mitchell is a Detroit Lion. We picked him in, in, in round five. We'll go from there and, uh, we'll talk about it a little bit more down the road. Um, I got a couple more videos to do, but thanks a lot guys for uh, paying attention. Thanks for uh, uh, tuning in. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button in the bottom right. Don't forget to get uh, hit the notification bell, get all my videos, and like and comment. You guys like the, the tight end, James Mitchell out of Virginia Tech. How you guys feeling about it? It was a round five pick. I thought it was, I thought it was a little bit early, but um, especially for a guy that's been banged up the last two years. But um, we'll see how it goes. He's probably he's obviously not taking over Hawkinson. And um, he'll be right now it looks like he'll be fighting with Brock Wright for that number two spot. So there it is, guys. Uh, James Mitchell in the house. Thanks for the video, guys. Go Lions. Boom.